In this short video, we'll look at how you can <coughs> create account lists and lead lists. And the reason you want to create account lists and lead lists is then within the lead filters, you can actually search specifically within those uh, those lists. It really starts to help narrow um, uh, narrow things down. So let's start with um, uh, an account list. So you go and find uh, the organization that you want to um, add to a list. So let's take Google. I've already started to create one called um, a test list. So you click on uh, plus sign. And then you go add to list. And then from here, you can either add it to um, the test list, or if you want to create a new one, you just start typing test list two, and then create uh, create new, or it could be key count or industry or whatever you want to call it, reflect how you run things in your um, CRM system. So I'm gonna add it to the uh, test list one, and then let's maybe use uh, meta as an example, so I'm going to add meta to uh, the test list. So drop down, I'm going to click save first, test list. So it's on that, um, uh, on that list. And bear in mind, you can actually also add notes. So again, I can add a note here. If you're on advanced or advanced plus, you can make these notes public or private, which means if, it's, if you make it public, anybody on Sales Navigator at your assets only with your own, own organization can see that note. So you could, you could, you know, key account client, client lead partner, client lead director is X, Y, Z. So that's how you can use um, notes. And if you have the CRM sync, then those notes can also move into your CRM, uh, CRM too. You can add as many as you want. I've started with those, um, uh, those uh, three. Creating lead lists again is also very straightforward. Um, I'm going to stick with Meta, um, but whenever you are in um, uh, this this format in terms of search, either by account or by leads, very simply, I'm just going to choose these people um, uh, random. So I go click save and then create a new list. And this will be test uh, Meta one, and then create and save, and then I'm going to. Save to list, test meta one, save to list, test meta one, save to list. I mean, you get the idea. And then your um, your lead lists, your account lists are then saved here, and your lead lists are then saved um, uh, saved here in terms of um, where you uh, where you find them. So that's how you create uh, lead lists.